Welcome back. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. So, I was recording and I was talking. Turned out that my voice a well earned victory wasn't recorded. And you know how many times I died to be here? I was pissed off. So what I did is I stopped recording. And I recorded from here properly. I didn't go back. So and there's nothing important anyway. So yeah. I'm kind of pissed off and I'm tired. But anyway, I'll tell you what I did so far. I practiced my skills a little more. I started studying the game mechanism. The spells don't do shit by the way. So don't spend on them. But if you were like striving for perfection or like achieving everything, unlocking every spell, then you can do it. Otherwise they they're not much of a help. Like when it comes to big boss fights. To humans, you can do it. But not the boss fights. And other thing was that when you're putting your flags like I did right now, whatever the morale you have is saved but if from here on you fight and your morale is like 15 or 16 but you die before reaching the other flag you can get it back if you obviously come back and defeat the person who defeated you but if you lose well people you forget about it anyway but you don't have to worry about it anyway do be careful. Yep. Obviously there is a boss fight. You know what I will do? I'll I'll practice a little more because I don't wanna like die 20-25 times because I'm already pissed off at what happened. So I'll take a little break and then I'll come back. Anyway, we're back people and yes, I practiced, I fought, I lost, I bled, I sweat. No, I sweat, I bled and all that. And I found a way to defeat him. And to be more honest, I died 12 times. But I cracked him. Dogs of the cracked him open. Are you? <laughs> Any who oppose us shall know only the end of our blades. So in the first phase, what you need to do is do not give him any space but just listen to what I'm saying okay yes I did got hurt but do not give him any space the benefit in this game you have is you don't have any stamina so you can smash as many times as you want without a care in the world so you keep smashing that piece of shit but if you give him the space make sure you're ready to be flat. like forget about healing forget about like giving aid to your partner or like forget about anything just get ready to be flat. anyway it's a pretty simple phase one i've all like won every single time so yeah second thing the only time your companion either well not the real life companion obviously but the AI companion gives you a little window when they see that your life reaches the red color or like you're about to die they will distract the boss so that you can heal so you take that opportunity don't get cocky simple a second fight or the second phase is a little tricky what is that power? I, General of Man, brother of the Great Sage Mentor! He sounds like Garrett from Final Fantasy. I shall not betray my brother's trust! Come in on below if you agree with me. Like that he sounds like Garrett. Anyway, did you see that? That big thing, yeah, that detachable arm, you need to deflect that. 
that's important in this thing give him full space now deflect every attack that he does first when he does this he's trusting at him you can deflect that i made a mistake but you can deflect when he does this you can dodge when he does trust you can deflect you can deflect these simple attacks as well but when it comes to this one you must be ready because he will not use his sword he will use his arm and you will see it from far away and anyway, that he's about to use his arm because he will use his sword like this to attack you so you need to be ready for this one. and don't worry about this move it's pretty simple he will just like uh, throwing you back that's his defense mechanic so you don't have to worry about it only three moves the thrust the spikes and the detachable arm like this keep doing oh you shut up man you're not doing anything anyway If you have the time you can dodge as far back as you want. If you don't want to you know deflect them you feel like scared. Now, the other thing, the move that he just did, it's pretty rare. It will only happen like in the end. So you need to be ready to deflect. By my head. Why are you? You shall die. He long. Every bit as strong as the rumors say. <laughs> that was stupid. I didn't know you have to actually click in order to continue. This world yeah. is steeped in chaos. Idiot didn't say either. It needs one like you to bring peace to it. I cannot let you die. So yes, like I wasn't able to properly explain, in the second phase, his actual health is still 50%. After that, the cutscene begins. So when he's like about to be 50% or a little bit lower than that, he will use a new move. So when he's like, when you see his health bar and you see that he's about to be like, you know, 50% ish you better be ready to deflect that's all you need to do like just deflect deflect and deflect nothing else just break his posture you don't need to attack him you don't need to do anything else to him so yes uh, this is it for today guys i hope you enjoyed the video and i'm so sorry i should have seen ke recording nahi ho rahi thi i made a mistake you would have loved it anyway uh i'll continue next time but i hope you liked the video if you did give a thumbs up subscribe to my channel comment down below if the villain sounded like garrett and 
I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.